worst thing about treating those combat boys wasn't that they had had their flesh torn. It was that they had had their souls torn out. I don't want to look in your eyes someday and see no spark, no love, no, no life. That would break my heart. It's funny with Pacific, it cost a lot of money to do, and we're kind of proud of that, how much it cost. You know, and it's not the same as what Avatar costs. It's not the same as what Harry, the latest, uh, you know, Harry Potter costs. So, um, you know, it's still television in terms of that, the budgetary thing. But, you know, they're big epics, and they're, it's just, it's so gratifying to work on. Australia was a fantastic place to shoot. You know, we, we shot up in the north, far north Queensland, to get all the beach stuff and the jungle stuff. And then for uh, all the studio stuff was down in Melbourne. And then about an hour outside of Melbourne, that's where, where we did all the Peleliu stuff in Iwo Jima. There's a fair amount of, of CGI in the Pacific, but it's really just sort of adding things on the, the outsides and, and putting planes in. We didn't have any planes flying over, so those are all CG planes. But uh, the landing of Peleliu, a lot of that is practical. So all the hero boats and, you know, and then camera boats going along with them and the land and stuff blowing up, it's, it's a good 60-70% was, was shot um, on the day. We're doing our best to recreate what it was like for these guys and there were miserable conditions in sh shooting in Australia. The episode I directed, which is about the uh, campaign on uh, Cape Gloucester on New Britain. It basically rained for four months and these guys were just, just miserable. So every day we'd show up to work and then the rain machines would start and we'd just be raining and we'd turn it off after the take. But um, it was nothing like what the real guys went through. You know, I've been working with, uh, with Tom Hanks on miniseries um, from Earth to the Moon when I got a phone call from my agent saying, and I was just a feature guy then, and saying, Tom Hanks is doing a, an HBO miniseries on the Apollo program, and I said, I'm in. There's a certain shorthand, you know, we, we know how to do these things to a degree. You know, if Tom called up and said, you know, I want to do a 10-part miniseries on the history of proctology, I would say, I'm in, you know, because I, I trust him. I mean, we don't agree on everything, but, you know, to agree 80, 90% of the time, that's, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm.